I often equate the Infobox widget to the card widget as they essentially have the same focus and that is to showcase information by combining different content elements into one widget. The main difference is that the card widget relies on images like photos, whereas the Infobox is more focused on icons. This makes the Infobox a candidate whenever you want to display product features, services or company values. The Infobox widget is free for Elementor from Happy Add-ons. Similar to the card, you will probably use the Infobox in columns and not across your entire page. And here is a very good example of an Infobox setup already in two columns. When I click on it, you will think, but this is already Infobox. It's called an icon box. And this is the standard widget that you get when you install Elementor free. So the info box is going to do a little bit more than this. And that's usually what you get from add-ons like these from Happy Add-ons is that it comes with more bling and a little bit more styling that you can make it stand out a little bit more than just the stock that you get with an Elementor free. Create a new section. Let's bring in three columns. And then from our widgets, we search for info box. There we go with our little smiley Happy Add-ons. Click and drag and drop it. And by default, you're immediately going to understand how this works. You're going to have your little icon there with a heading, a description, and then you also have a link here for a button. Let's have a look at what we get in terms of designs. The first one, design one, design two, that will allow you to bring in an image, design three, four, five, and you can see essentially what we're doing is just moving things around, styling it out and hopping between whether we are going to use an icon or whether we will be using an image. But everything is nicely set up for you. So there's no need for you to think too much about how am I going to apply that border? How do I get it in the center? And these are excellent presets to start off with. Let's go back to something like design number one. Under this, your icon image. So you have the option to choose from the icons that we all know and love. And then also in case you rather want an image. And you can see the moment we go to image, it's almost a card widget, which I think more or less for all intents and purposes, very similar. But keep in mind that when we're working on an info box, we, we work with something smaller, usually an icon, and we are focused on things like features. When you are selling a product, the features, or if you have a business, what kind of services you offer. And if you're working on a company, you may want to add the company's values here in compliance or their sustainability for the environment. Those are the kind of things that I'm thinking of here. And then the normal title and description, all of those things, your button link over here, and then you're going to do your styling over here. What I think is always good to do when you're working with happy add-ons is to go to the website and look at their demos. Why? Because you can copy those demos and paste them ready-made. You only need to switch out the content. Follow the link in the description below, go to the page. And here I have this demo from them that I think, okay, I like this demo. And then we use the live copy feature. If you don't know what the live copy feature is, check out the video here at websites for beginners. Click on live copy and wait for it to say copied. Then we go back to our page, find your section, then right click and click paste live paste. And it's going to think a little bit, go search for all those things that it needs to bring in. And it's going to import that demo as is here on your page. And the only thing you need to do is probably make a few changes to your container. Like this case, I'm going to put it on full width and you'll need to make styling changes to the colors but then it is already set up for you. You don't need to think too much about it. It's ready to go. In terms of responsiveness for tablet and mobile, if we go into the info box, you're going to find that under styling and it's mostly going to relate to padding and text size. When it comes to your column breaks, those you are going to be doing on your column settings and not in terms of your info box itself. So here you have them stack and that's done all through your section and the columns within the section. And that gives us the second one to the family. We had the cart, we have the info box. If you want to know more about happy add-ons for Elementor, follow the link in the description below from me, JP. Stay safe, have a nice day and see you in the next video.